So we have a controller board out of a massage chair here. I noticed while measuring around on this board that we're missing the 5 volt rail. And I have a hunch that if we replace this uh, regulator, we have a 12 volts in ground and then we should have 5 volts out and we don't. So I'm going to go ahead and replace that and we're going to see if we can get it working. All right, so I have the board here. Um, originally, I was going to use hot air from the top and I do not have my microscope camera hooked up. So we'll just have to wait for that for now. So I'm going to heat the uh, board from the bottom and we should be able to remove this. All that smoke is actually coming from the flux. As soon as that solder just liquefies like that, boom, we're done. That's it, that's all we need. So I'm gonna prep this part with a little bit of solder on the back side of it. That way we can just go ahead and blow it right into place on the board. Okay, and because uh, I totally second guess myself, we are gonna use a little bit of hot air underneath this board here. And the reason is because we're gonna go ahead and try to blow this uh, regulator into place. Make sure that the center is connected to the ground. It is. Okay. You sure? Yeah. Okay. First things first, let's plug in this board. You know, before we plug in the board, let's uh, just grab it, put it in volts mode, and turn this on. Oh, you know what, before we turn it on, we have to plug in the board, the AC power. AC power is plugged in, turn the board on. Just hit ground, 5 volts. We got 5 volts, 5 volts is now present, yes, 4.8, 7 volts, that's fine. Alright, cool, we got 5 volts present now, and let's plug in this board here, alright, and turn on the board, and it's working. Can we turn it on? And it's working. All because of a 5 volt regulator, that just died. How you put that in? Well, Dad, because you're amazing. That's right. You're amazing. <laughs> Say it again. <laughs> Say it again. Say it again. <laughs> well, this whole thing just quit working because of a 5-volt regulator. 12 volts in, ground, and 5 volts out, and there was no 5 volts. We did not have 5 volts present. And we tested that because we plugged power into the board. We test for 5 volts. We test for the voltage rails on the board, and 5 volts wasn't present. We know that the, what is it, 7805? Yep. 7805 voltage regulator is going to be the output um, for this board for the 5 volt rail. 5 volts wasn't present. We replaced that. 5 volts is not present and it now works. So, yeah, uh, I guess we fix uh, reclining chair, uh, couch, uh, massage chairs, or whatever. So, yeah, if you guys enjoyed this video, definitely leave a like and subscribe, and I'll see you guys in the next one.